You guys, you, re you have this one ready to write down? Yes, I do. Okay. So now for the next one, I have p of x equals 4x squared minus 3. So now what they're asking us to do is now I want you to evaluate my function p for a squared. So it gets a little bit more confusing because you're not evaluating it for a number anymore. But you're just going to apply the same things. You're not evaluating it for a number. You're now evaluating it for a squared. So wherever you apply an x, you're now going to apply an a squared. So this is going to equal 4 times a squared squared minus 3. Now when we look at this, remember a squared raised to the power, power of power you multiply. So you're going to get 4 a to the 4 minus 3. I can't simplify that any further. P a squared is going so my function p evaluate at a squared is going to equal 4a to the fourth minus 3. So we just put an a squared for x? Yeah. yeah. 